for a stick. For a stick, the 1971 graduate of Sterling High School completed an associate's degree at Rangeley Junior College before getting his bachelor's at the University of Northern Colorado in 1975. He followed with an MA from the same school in 1981. Coach Dick took over the basketball program at Green Mountain High School in 1982 and by 2000 had the teams in state tournaments nine times. The Rams won the 5A state championship in 1992 and were runners-up in 1991 and 1994. Bruce followed this very successful start with stints at Rocky Mountain High School from 2005 to 2010, Resurrection Christian High School from 2010 to 2020, and Fort Collins High School from 2021 to present. The Coach Dick-led teams have been a regular entrance in the state tournament at all of those schools. Rocky Mountain played in the Grade 8 in 2008, Resurrection Christian finished runners-up in 2015 and 2016, and in 2020, the team was undefeated through the state quarterfinals, after which the tournament was canceled due to COVID. Fort Collins finished the 2023 season in the Grade 8 of the 6A tournament. Bruce served a term as the Chaska Boys Basketball President Coach in multiple All-State games and received the association's Tom Sutak Award in 2004. Basketball has been a family affair for the Dick family. Bruce has roamed the sidelines while his wife Terry has served as the official team scorekeeper and son, Brian, now husband of Melissa, was the videographer for several of the teams at Green Mountain, Rocky Mountain, and Resurrection Christian. Well, I got started in sports by following my brother around, who was five years older and I was the little brother. I cannot actually remember when I wasn't involved in sports. The reason I became a coach, uh, just the passion of the sports. I, I just love sports. Uh, many influences in, in my life, I think, to actually become that coach. Uh, my high school coach, Dwayne Pilkington, was a big influence was fortunate to play some college baseball and my junior college coach, Paul Conrad. I had the honor to uh, student teach under Tom Asbury, who was a successful uh, high school and college coach. And I, I think those three really had an influence on my coaching career. I've had a passion for sports and kids. I just love being around youth, love being around kids. My wife, I, I don't think you can do this for as many years as I have done successfully without a, uh, a wife that just has your back. A man of faith, I just think knowing God is always there with you. And most important, players. Uh, of all the players that I've been blessed to have with throughout the years, uh, no coach can be successful without uh, tremendous kids and players. Oh, co coaching is giving back, just seeing all the growth of youth and, and the emotions that you go through when you see a young man or lady come in at one stage and leaving at another stage. And it's, it, it's that reward that you see the success of others. It was very emotional. Uh, you know, just thinking back of all the coaches and people I've been involved with and, and how many of them should probably be in this seat right now and, and have not reached there. But, uh, just it's very very humbling but it was very emotional very humbling and just so rewarding and feel so blessed on uh, being able to be recognized into the high school colorado high coaches hall of fame tonight help us welcome coach bruce stick as the 2024 inductee into the colorado high school coaches association hall of fame 